Welcome to teaching classes COVID 2019 spring semester. It's finals week and believe it or not, I'm almost done. But I thought, you know, what the student doesn't usually get to see is how do we do this and what does my life look like when we're flipping around and making this work? So I thought, hey, let me give a quick summary of what's going on and how I'm getting ready for classes, not just now, but in the fall. So this is this is my work environment. This is a uh, TV room that we converted into an office. Extra table, nice area, my trash can from when I was a kid. And as we're putting this all together, we are now looking at how I can be as productive as humanly possible. So when we all got started, the first thing I did was I asked the IT department, I said, hey, you know what? Those computer screens make me more productive. That chair is more comfortable than sitting, honestly, there or in a folding chair. So the first thing I did about getting ready is to find a way to be as productive as I possibly could. So where do we go from here? Right now, I am preparing for classes for fall of 2020. I've got my books out, I've got the plan play in place, but we're looking at classes either being face-to-face -face and in person, live or hybrid, which means some of it's online and some of it's face-to-face, -face, face -face, or it could all be online like it has been for the last eight weeks. Either way, I need to be prepared as we go forward to deliver the best possible experience I can. So part of the time I'm reading books, the new rules of marketing and PR are pretty darn exciting to me. Contagious, why things catch on. <laughs> kind of a uh, uh, interesting title for a book. It has to do with marketing, not with pandemics in this case. But then we've got books of, that we're continually thinking about. Managerial Accounting, Drive by uh, Pink, Service America, Outliers. All of these books are beginning to help me decide how do we educate post-pandemic 2021, post-pandemic 2020. Understand that the best book analogy I can get is the parable of who moved my cheese. I'm thinking everybody's got their cheese moved and we have to be prepared to work with it. So as you're going forward, as I'm going forward, we have to think about who moved my cheese and what are we going to do about it? And how can we prepare? Each and every one of us is going to make that happen. Oh, and by one... By, by the way, one other thing. Everybody should have a supply of jelly beans on their desk because, you know, in the middle of the afternoon, sugar rush is good.